For some students, the question what to do for a career can be a loaded question. Students at Cass Lake Bina, many of which may be the first in their families to go to college, are getting extra help getting there. Teachers at the school have implemented many strategies to guide the students in every grade, as Mal Meyer reports for this week's Golden Apple. Uh, there's the assignment in Google Classroom. The high school was named an initial priority school in 2012 by the Minnesota Department of Education. Priority schools are the 5% most persistently low-performing Title I schools in the state based on testing proficiency, growth, achievement gap reduction, and graduation rates. We were sended from that. The district took swift action, becoming a reward school in 2014 for improvements in these areas. But I think this staff um, and the students understand here that we don't want to settle for just improvement. We want to continue to make gains every year, and I think that's happened. One of the things they're looking to improve is their graduation rate. In 2015, the four-year graduation rate was at 74.2 percent, up by about 11 percent over the prior year. For a small school, we have lots of opportunities. Through AP courses and Project Lead the Way, which provide college credit, teachers are giving the students a taste of their postgrad studies. Families that have never had a student be in college um, have ninth graders, 10th graders, and on up earning college credits while they're here. Maddie White is preparing to take the ACT test in the spring through the school. She'll need good scores in order to get into her pick of the Twin Cities. Those practice tests are helping me to um, figure out what I need to work on to get a better score. Sydney Foster is planning on going to UND Grand Forks with a major in speech pathology. She says staff has been very supportive through the application process. And like always are trying to help you get to that next step of like scholarships, a FAFSA, like anything that you need, like they're there to help you. For some of the students, they're holding out for their careers course to get a better understanding of the opportunities that lie ahead. I was gonna make my decision later on in the year when I get into like careers classes and AP stuff. The teachers hope that projects like these help inspire the students for their postgrad ventures. In Cass Lake, I'm Mal Meyer, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.